Hello and welcome. Uh, in this video, we're going to work on this problem together, uh, but why don't you pause the video and give it a shot on your own? Thanks. Okay, so when they say determine the product, what do they mean? They mean multiply. And we've got three numbers 800.5, 2, and 10 to the 6. 10 to the 6 is a 1 followed by 6 zeros. That's a million. And that might make this problem seem overwhelming, but it's actually quite a nice problem to solve. What I'm going to do first is take 800.5 and multiply it by 2. I'm going to double it. And because I'm just multiplying here, I can multiply in any order I want. I think of 800.5 doubled as 800 plus 800 and then 0.5 plus 0.5. And that gets me 1600 and 1. And we're taking that and multiplying it by 10 to the 6th. Notice none of these choices match it exactly, but I can see A and C, 1.7, are a little bit off. It's got to be 1.601, or 1 uh, times 10 to the 7th, or 1.601 times 10 to the 9th. I see those same digits appearing here. Um, so how do I fi figure it out? Well, um, I'm going to realize that, I, I realize, excuse me, that the decimal is between the 1 and the 6 here. My decimal is all the way over here after the 1. So to get it back over between the 1 and the 6, I have to divide it by 10 once, twice, three times. Essentially, you have to divide this number by 10 to the third. Remember, every time you divide by 10, your decimal goes to the left. So I have to divide it by 10 to the third, or dividing it by 10 three times is the same as dividing by 1,000. So it's 1.601. But I can't leave it 10 to the sixth, right? I've now changed the number. I've divided one of the factors in the number by 1,000. So I made it essentially 1,000 times smaller. So to balance that out, I have to make this part 1,000 times bigger. Multiply it by 10 to the third. And we multiply these two, since we have the same base, 10 and 10, we can just multiply 6 and, oh, excuse me, add 6 and 3 to get 9. We can add those exponents. And that's our answer, which is choice D. All right, I hope this helped.